Good morning, guys. I just got ready to go to the airport. It's 7 in the morning. My cute little sweat set is from Sporting Rich. This hat I got from this other friends. It's like a merch hat from this restaurant. And I am ready to go. I'm going to Vail, Colorado. Um, and I'm going to take you guys with me. <laughs> It is not as cold as I thought it was going to be, which is nice. Um, just rented a car and we're on our way to Vail, which is like 30 minutes where we're staying. And I really want to find a coffee somewhere. Just sat for lunch, got some drinks, some pretzel lights. My first day, travel day, is complete and I need to take off my makeup. I hate taking off my makeup. I wish I could just like snap my fingers and be in bed. Skin has been feeling super dry and this isn't helping, but look at this cute little mini. I love minis whenever I travel. I triple cleanse just because I feel like I wear so much makeup and I'm taking everything off. So I got the Desi skin. I've seen Desi stuff all over my TikTok and Instagram. And I love Desi. Desi's one of those like influencers that like one of the first girls that I started following. And I like I've been obsessed with her since forever. And I always talk about her on my podcast and stuff just because I love her so much. And she has this like makeup melting balm. And I like the fact that you don't have to like dig through it and it's just kind of like this and this gentle detox cleansing thing. I think I might actually jump in the shower. Um, and then I also got this hydrating body wash, which this brand reminds me of used to live in London because I feel like that's such a, like, a UK brand, Soap and Glory. Maybe I'm wrong. It smells okay. This always freaking confuses me. The whole entire shower is fucky because I like to shower with like, the hottest water possible. I'm gonna keep it simple but effective for my skincare because as I said before, I just need a lot of moisture. It is winter time. I love cuddly products. And tip, if you are going to Europe, make sure you buy a bunch because they're a lot cheaper in France, for example. I really want to do my heatless curls, so I'm going to show you how I do them. There with some leave-in conditioner. This one's from Wade. I really like this. I finished about like five, six bottles of this, but I'm always trying out new products, trying out new things, and I try not to be wasteful. Like even if I don't like a product, I will keep using it until I finish it, and then I just won't buy it again. Brands want to send me things like I only accept things that I actually want to use or want to try because I hate being wasteful and I hate clutter and stuff accumulating in my home. Uh, my skin is so dry right here. I use a clip to secure it on one side and then I start picking up some hair, trying to be as close to the scalp as possible and trying to be as tight as possible without pulling the hair and then i also grab some hair from the back so it's not just the front bits that are curled that being said my heatless curls last literally two seconds i think i have really like fine hair so it just like it doesn't hold a curl the way i wish it did i don't think it's bad for your hair though because it's not really like hugging, pulling your hair like crazy, so it's better than using a curling iron. I just hate washing my hair when I'm not like home and I have like all my products and my favorite like microfiber towels and all that stuff like chair like in my vanity when I blow dry my hair, I listen to my podcast like I don't know, my hair always turns out better. And then I just secure it. I love this little silk scrunchies. I mean, I've had the like 
really shitty Amazon 50 pack and these you, you can tell the difference which sucks <laughs> in the back and I'm gonna go to bed and I'm actually gonna apply this on the really dry skin good morning you guys I'm just getting ready for the day I'm also filming on TikTok um, I did not sleep that well. I missed my bed. So now, just getting ready. Your girl is ready for the mountains. lunch my husband is skiing I am not I hate skiing I'm walking back I am so full there's something so satisfying about snow boots and the sound they make when they touch snow I love it I'm super full I'm gonna edit last week's vlog, which I haven't done yet, but first I really wanna get some hot chocolate because the place we're staying, like in the lobby, there's always hot chocolate, which I think is so cute. I wish there were marshmallows. Oh my God, I'm out of breath. I'll be there. Perfect. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Okay, got dressed for dinner. Favorite perfume is the Mazon Ella Rose at the moment. Some water. Look at this cute little jewelry bag. I got this in Saint Tropez at this market, and they do this like market every Sunday and Tuesday, and they have the most special, coolest pieces, um, including like a stand that makes these. How cute! And they have like a stand that has like vintage Louis Vuitton trunks and vintage Chanel and like stuff that you've like never seen before and I think the prices are good but like the bags you can tell they're like weathered and stuff I just think it's like really cool if you're in Central Pay or if you're in the south of France I think it's worth going you get like a coffee and a croissant and they have like so much like jewelry oh should I do a necklace too I do not know when to stop when it comes to jewelry. with almond milk and sugar-free caramel it tastes so good it's been snowing all day it's kind of late actually it's like 10 50 um late start to the day i woke up early but i've been just laying in bed rotting but i'm gonna go to the gym so i thought i'd show you if i'm gonna do a workout on vacation this is kind of what i do i don't like to go like super hard and i don't know i just like to do like a light workout it usually consists of like 30 minutes mat pilates and then i'll do 30 minutes on the treadmill just like light walking while i'm on the phone i've been napping both days that i've been here which is not great because then i can't sleep at night <laughs> You're probably gonna see them on my Instagram by now. 5% of it, so the is like, I conquered. Staying there. Honestly, I have to stay there for three to four years. 
just had the most amazing massage of my entire life and they gave me a freshly baked chocolate chip cookie after which was just heaven and now I'm just waiting for my Uber gonna head back home yeah that was just amazing I showed you I was in the Uber and it was snowing like crazy and I was going back to like where I'm staying and my husband had already skied back with his friends and I was in the Uber and the guys like they blocked all the roads like you're stuck like I can't take you back home and I was like sir what do you mean I can't get back home like I, cause I was like okay this is gonna be my new life I'm gonna have to like find a place to live here and like I'm like I'm stuck here and I was like yeah, you're gonna have to get out and walk and i was like sir it is literally like a there's a blizzard outside i'm i'm literally just a girl and then i called my husband i was like freaking out come rescue me because there was like a back road that he could drive through and he came to pick me up but the uber driver in the meantime he had to like wait with me in the car for like eight minutes he was like getting so angsty he was like you're gonna have to get out of the car you're gonna have to get out of the car you're gonna have to like walk walk to him and i was like i'm begging you sir please another two minutes i was like trying to milk it and then eventually he was like nope you gotta go so like i was out of the car like trying to walk to where my husband was driving from and it was there was like a blizzard i have like all this snow on my face i'm freezing and i'm like shit anyways it's all good now we're good we're back in the house we're back in the cozy cozy home but that was so scary you guys are enjoying the vlog so far it's something that is very different from everything that i've done so far like youtube is not like my forte but i am trying and try and put out good content and show you guys what i really do i will speak to you tomorrow which is basically the last full day here um thursday we go back home but we have to check out at like 10 and our flight's at five i hate that i hate the time between the checkout and the flight like that is the most brutal time i'm on my way to get some lunch it is my last day here tomorrow i'm leaving i'm excited to go home i missed my house and my routine it's nice to be away for a few days the sun is shining and i'm very hungry so i think i can scare my husband he gets really jumpy and i love scaring him when he comes into the room and i think he's gonna come soon so i'm just gonna wait until he does hey oh, <laughs> oh this is my favorite thing in the world <laughs> <laughs> Don't make fun of me, but I love this I love it. That's right. Nothing more perfect than an Arnold Palmer. I'm having a beverage day, I feel like today. Look at this lunch, lunch review.